more and more societies worldwide find the fight against global warming is one of the key priorities. The energy consumption is supposed to double until 2040. And the biggest part of the growth here is stemming from economies like China and India. By increasing renewable energy generation capacity, they can contribute to an emission reduction, but at the same time naturally address the energy hunger of their increasing economic development. It's not enough to just build renewable energy generation capacity. You also have to address the question of transportation and storage. And this is where also the large opportunity here for hydrogen and fuel cells comes from, because at the end, you have to convert the hydrogen again into clean electrical energy in a very efficient way. And this is the logical role here for the fuel cell. Fuel cells are already used in a wide range of applications. They are used as um, onboard power supply in motorhomes, caravans, in sailing boats. They are used for civil surveillance. They are used in critical infrastructure. Fuel cell is an electrochemical converter. It converts directly fuel to electricity. Fuel cells have a very high energy density. They do never run down. And depending on the fuel, the operation is 100% climate neutral. SFC Energy is one of the worldwide leaders for hydrogen and methanol fuel cells for stationary and portable applications. Since the founding of the company, we have produced more than 8 million kilowatt hours of electric energy with the fuel cells. And we have saved uh, more than 4,300 tons of CO2, yeah, which represents roughly 4,300 flights from um, Munich to New York. Our fuel cells emit no environmentally harmful exhaust gases like nitrogen oxides, carbon monoxide, and also no fine dust. It is highly efficient with less noise and less material input. We really aim to address um, the two mega trends, digitalization and decarbonization. Yeah, via the EFOIL cloud, for example, the management of the fuel cell can be controlled and adjusted. And together with the EFOIL battery, the EFOIL fuel cell, for example, forms the EFOIL hybrid power package. And this is a package that is intelligent and is designed to ideally operate together and is highly efficient. Research and development is really a key part of our product strategy. We are developing integrated electrolyzers. We are working on the usage of green methanol. We are working on high power hydrogen fuel cells. And uh, we are developing H2 Genset. It's an emission-free uh, generator powered by hydrogen. We want to provide environmentally friendly energy everywhere, also in the most extreme situations. Mosaic was a year-round expedition uh, to study climate conditions. Um, it was the largest and first expedition of its kind. There were 600 people involved. They needed a robust power source um, to power the measurement systems in Arctic conditions. And it had to work autonomously for one to two months without user intervention. And for that, SFC has developed a customized um, energy box 4060P, including EFOIL Pro fuel cells and um, 120 liter of methanol, which provides 120 kilowatt hours of energy. Our product was able to work and to power the measurement systems in these uh, really harsh climate conditions. G7 Summit requires a surveillance um, video technology. So our partner in UK was requested to supply some surveillance technologies, some surveillance towers with video cameras. And we here on our side um, have simply designed the energy source to it. it means they were powered by the EFOIL um, fuel cell technologies 24-7. Yeah, yeah, they were completely independent, mobile. So this was yeah, the target and we fully certified them. If you have long-term power outages, the states and municipalities, they need to make sure that critical systems continue to work. And also in, in vehicles, for example, of police or fire brigade, um, the fuel cells are used to power the onboard equipment. For example, communication equipment, lightning, um, or special signalization equipment. All these can be powered by the fuel cell. There is a massive macro trend that drives the demand here for clean energy generation and increasing 
demand here for environmental friendly solutions. Replacing diesel generators and gensets in a broad sense. And we have been building up an offering of products over the last 15 to 20 years by combining renewable energy generation with hydrogen and fuel cells and therefore contribute to the reduction of emissions in a significant and positive way. The future is bright and we expect to grow further.